doing a puzzle. Uh, there is, this is from our friends at Craft Hub. Want to thank them for sending this out. This is a premium Wait. wooden puzzle. So these pieces are chonky. They are, that's a, the official word, I believe, is chonky. What is this for? Uh, that is, um, when you're done with the puzzle, you can, it's, I believe it's a stand where you can stand what? up the puzzle. Yeah. So here are the pieces. I mean, this, this, this is not your typical, um, puzzle, folks. Jigsaw puzzle where it's cardboard. This is wooden. These are laser cut wood pieces with beautiful, beautiful, um, colors on them. And we have the turtle, which we're doing here. It's La Tortuga. La Tortuga. And then, oh, look, it's a little on the back of the little kitty cat. That's funny. Do they, they do all that? count? Oh, or do they? No, some of them do. I don't know. That's a secret thing. Like, there's a turtle on that. But, oh. yeah, aren't these pieces nice, though? Yeah. Gorgeous. So, just looking at this, I'm assuming this is, like, his, um, the arm, the front arm. Yeah, looks like just it's his water dot. Yeah. And then the shell. Oh, hey, there's threads in the bag. Yeah. And for those of you that are watching on YouTube later on, um, I will put a, uh, there should be a link in the description uh, to where you can uh, get this puzzle. Uh, Imaginary says, I've, I'll have to check them out. My wife love, loves puzzles. Yeah, we do too. And these are just, oh, I feel like they're the next level as far as quality. Oh, um, for sure. Right? This is, we did puzzles when we were like dating. Yeah. Uh, thanks to Michelle. I had never done a thousand piece puzzle until I met Michelle. I'd done puzzles as a kid, but we never really got into it hardcore. But what was it? I think I found one a used puzzle at the library, and it just had it was like a Noah's Ark theme. Yes. And it, I was really attracted to it because there was a lot of animals and it was like super colorful, like sort of along these lines. And I looked at it, I was like, I've never done a thousand piece puzzle. So I asked Michelle, and she, it turned out she loved puzzles. Look at this! One of the pieces in that is an actual turtle. Oh wow! How cool is that? So we're making huh. a turtle, and there's a, a piece that looks like a turtle. And what's interesting is this it's doesn't have, like, standard, like, edges. You know, it's like, oh, let's build yeah. the border first. They're all, like, if you can tell here. Yeah, different. Right here. Uh, when the background's black, you yeah. can see better. There's a lot of different shapes. And this one's a kitty cat? There's a lot of curly cues, like curly tail. Yeah. They must have known we have pugs. <laughs> So yeah, we want, excuse me. Want to thank Craft Hub uh, for sending this over our way. This is so interesting. Each one here's like a little peacock. Huh? I haven't found very many that have a thing on the back. Yeah, and then this is like a a wolf or something or some kind of dog. Oh. Wolf. Yeah. Well, this one was a star. Yeah. Oh, here's another. <laughs> I one. recognize that one. Another like dog. Tub. Oh. Very oh, cool. Interesting. Yeah. I'm, just, I'm thinking of, you know, having to cut this out. <laughs> yeah. This is, I don't know, next level. Yeah, it's not like your standard, you know, puzzle. Like, you have your edges and whatnot. So, I, I don't know. How do we do this? Do we just, like, go by color? Which is tough for me, but that's okay. Pattern? Like, you can pattern, pattern, yeah. I can do these patterns here. I recognize this is, like, the fin. His front fin. And then this is, obviously, like, the shell. Right? Okay, so these little stripes, they're the lines in between each mm -hmm. little section. Yeah. Huh. Really <laughs> okay, so these here. are pugtail pieces. Yes. Yeah. Oh, Steph Raccoon says, there's a puzzle exchange thing near us, like a little free library style box fixed to a tree on the sidewalk, but instead of books, it's puzzles. Works in a take a puzzle, leave a puzzle. Wait, oh, oh, that's so that's, cool. that's a great idea. Genius. Because what do you do with your puzzles, like, once you've done them? Yeah. You always, like, gift them. Like, I've we've gifted a few to our uh, nieces and nephew. We, well, we put quite a few on Buy Nothing. Yeah. On our local Buy Nothing group on Facebook, uh, we just we just put a big old batch of mm -hmm. puzzles, right? And then somebody was asking for um, puzzles for their 70-year-old mother. Because mm. she likes to do puzzles. I'm like, I just, I love Buy Nothing. Yeah. Buy Nothing is great. Wow, this is interesting. I'm overwhelmed. Look at that. I got one. <laughs> My first one. Woohoo. Look at that. Yeah, you're right with these pug curly tail things. Really interesting. This is... This is hey, GB Glazer. Happy New Year, friend. <laughs> Good to see you. Hope you're well. GB Glazer in the house. 
Maybe we should do a um, little library of puzzles. That would be great. Can we do that? Yeah. Or we we do have a little library uh, in our neighborhood. Maybe we could just sort of leave a note saying, hey, we got some puzzles. It's okay to leave them here. Yeah. You know, since they already have the um, box up, the little library box up, that is. Yeah, our nearest local little library is really cute. It's really geared for kids. She puts... um chalk sidewalk chalk in there oh, so yeah. the kids can draw stuff around you know the sidewalk near their house and um i don't know she puts like a lot of like cute things in there yeah and there's also adult books too yeah yeah you can tell she cares hey i got another one yay i'm happy i got two pieces or well, four pieces i got together. um actually some gym jackets from her oh really by nothing yeah oh so she's also local or active in the by nothing group cool i think i donated a bunch of books to her as well nice wow this is gb glazer what's new i don't know oh gb glazer i gotta show y'all michelle got me my otani jersey super excited um off the black market he says yeah off the black market <laughs> <laughs> no it's legit folks it really is legit just in case anyone watching on youtube is um from the fbi or whatever <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, this one looks like a like an octopus. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's so interesting. Oh, here's a bird. Oh yeah. Look at that. It's so cool. So we've got a couple of these puzzles. Uh once again, the show notes uh the description will have links. You could get 20% off your order using the code Ruel20. I have not gotten any pieces <clears throat> together. <laughs> and uh Magic Air says, <clears throat> Oh yeah, that's a great question. It looks like on the website that there are various sizes of each puzzle on that site. Does it say yes? So this puzzle we're doing is a large A3. Large A3 premium wooden puzzle. This is the um, turtle, sea turtle. Yeah, I got a, a squirrel. You can see oh, that. cool. <laughs> yeah, I, I love Squirrel that. on the turtle. Does that actually show on this picture? I don't know. I don't think it shows here. Yeah, Ben, definitely no. European sizing, right? Yeah, it doesn't show on here either. I was thinking it was supposed to fit on here, but obviously uh, not. <laughs> okay. Wow, this is hard. It's interesting, right? This is different than any of the puzzle we've done together. For sure. Oh, does that fit? Oh! Those look at that together. yeah but they don't like lock in so that you're gonna have to like get the pieces around it huh yeah interesting okay i'm done okay cool. <laughs> you're on your own yeah you know i'm actually a little hungry so why don't we go do dinner and okay. we'll we'll call it a call it a stream for now okay okay but now i, I really want to do this so. yeah we will <laughs> we will continue this thank you again for hanging out and We'll clip this, and it's going to be on YouTube or uh, here on Twitch. But uh, thank you for watching. Folks, that's going to be it uh, for tonight. Um, it is Friday Fun Day. Hope you have a wonderful weekend. Michelle's still going on the puzzle. 